I am a red man. If the Great Spirit had desired me to be a white man, he would have made me so in the first place. God made me an Indian. The First Nations people have been given a message, have awakened to righteousness. A new thing is coming. A new wave is coming. Upon suffering beyond suffering, the Red Nation shall rise again, and it shall be a blessing for a sick world. In the midst of diversity, there will be unity. In the midst of suffering, there will be healing. There will be restoration. You as Indians are a sleeping giant. You are now awakening. You may become a spiritual superpower in this country that could change not only America, but the world. The sleeping giant is no longer asleep. It is moving. It is moving. And I challenge every tribe Rise! We're going to lead because we're ordained to lead this last great awakening. Get ready. Hebrew people, the Jewish people, were put on reservations. And today, the American Indians are still on reservations. And I believe what we've seen in the book of Exodus is going to take place right before our eyes here in America. I believe that the Native American people are the key to a tremendous move of God, a revival that's getting ready to sweep the earth. It is Kairos time for us, and I'm seizing that moment. I'm seizing this time. We feel a sense of urgency to, to partner with kingdom shakers up on the reservation with people who are not willing to to settle with what history said, but are willing to really pursue what destiny says. So God is going to use us, and there is going to be a change, and it's going to start from us. Well, God is getting ready to do something very powerful in America. God's getting ready to move a powerful, powerful move like we have never, ever seen before. Never. And we need the uh, input from the Native Americans. They have a spiritual authority to break the darkness of witchcraft, the control over America. It's an awakening. It's, it's, it's all about God. God has connected them with China, Korea, and Israel for a move of God unlike any other. For God has spoken, I have now turned my face to the host people of the land, for blood cries from the ground. Now is our time, people. Now is our time. Get ready.